Welcome to the design review tutorial video series. Uh, we will be using design review and we'll be learning its functions of measuring, navigating uh, the 2D version of the DWF file and also the 3D DWF file. To get started we'll go through exercise one measuring DWFs and so the very first thing we need to do is open our original set .dwf just by double clicking on the file and we'll open up Autodesk Design Review with that specific construction document. If you start on your home tab that's fine in this ribbon. What we want to do is select the markup and measure tab in this ribbon and we're going to zoom in to the garage area. We can hold our middle mouse button down by uh, holding down the middle mouse wheel that pans and we can move the mouse around or we can spin the middle mouse wheel to actually zoom in and out so we can navigate to the garage area what we'll do is select the lengthen tool then we will go down to the corner till this our icon turns to a white circle then we select one point then another and we get a dimension. The dimension is pretty close. It should be near 19 foot. So I have 18, 11, and 7 inches, an eighth of an inch off, but that's uh, pretty close. What we'll then do is select that same bottom left corner with our left mouse button, and then select another corner down here in the bottom right to pull up the dimension of 19 foot 5 if we want to take an area of a certain room we can use this area tool it's next to the length tool again we'll hover over this corner until it turns white and then we'll select this corner down here and then let's select this corner down here then we'll select this last corner here and hit escape and we should have a square footage that comes up that's 369 square feet. I'll leave you to try this out on your own. 